Sơn mọi bao của em guys welcome back to my channel welcome to fish academy uh we are in a project site in uh, Omohaya, uh where we are doing a remodeling uh, we are re doing remodeling of uh, uh the fish farm here uh, we are remodeling it to let let me say to 2020 model in terms of uh, oh sorry i think there's a lot of sunfly here so we are remodeling it to 2020 model uh, in terms of the the piping system and um, actually this farm was not constructed by me looking at the the type of farm you know who constructed it uh, so today is a uh, 16 day of uh, December 2019 and uh, my client after watching me on my channel seeing the type of project that I do, seeing my type of connection, my type of farm, uh, decide to contract me to come and do a remodeling here in the farm. And uh, we, we've arrived site since in the morning and uh, we're going to walk you around so that you see what we've done inside on our day one, being the 16th day of uh, December 2019. So we came in here with, uh, with our asphalt cutting uh, machine. As you can see, we came in here with our asphalt uh, cutting machine in order to do our cutting. We, we came up the, the DPC, that was where we did our cutting, and we are done cutting the DPC. So let me, let, uh, let's walk in, let's go in so you see uh, the nursery, nursery pond. As I said, it was not constructed by me, as you can see, but uh, we are going to do... So, this is, it. this is where we are going to work. We are not breaking anything here. We are not going to break the pond now. But we are, what we are going to do, what we were contracted to do, is just to uh, do the, the, the to repipe the overflow system, which is also going to be with the discharge uh, uh, pipe. You know, I, I usually say if you are connecting a pipe, when you are doing your overflow, it's not all about uh, running an overflow water surface or it's not all about discharging the surface water during your overflow it's all about uh, discharging the underground water the bottom water that is the most important water to discharge during your overflow maybe when you are doing your total flow through or anytime you want to do your flow through the water that should be discharged to your overflow pipe is not the surface water it should be the underground water that is all uh, the that is what the remodeling is all about and that is what we are going to do here this is the nursery area and over there we have the ash tree that is where they are going to be doing the ashing so let's walk down to where we have the grout uh, pond <laughs> Okay, so this is where we have uh, the grow pond. Uh, we have uh, eight on this row and eight on this other row. So altogether we have uh, 16 uh, grow pond here. 
And uh, from what I see here, I believe this is going to take uh, uh, about uh, 25, sorry, about 2,500 fish each. 2,500 fish each. And if you multiply that, that is going to be about, uh, about uh, 45,000 capacity fish farm. That is what we're having here. So as I said, we came in here with our asphalt cutting machine and we are done with the cutting here so that we can do the repiping in this place. We're going to repipe. You know, so we cut, so we're going to remove the top layer, the, the, the DPC that was cast here. We're going to remove that entirely, and then we are going to do new connection entirely here. You know, that's what uh, Fish Academy is known for. When you're talking about Fish Academy, you should be talking about fish, you should be talking about construction of fish farm. And I do tell people it's not all about, I, I don't want to be a jack a master of uh, all and then uh, a jack of all trade master of none you know i just want to ensure i concentrate mostly on what we are doing which is fish farming though we can construct any other thing if you want us to construct your poultry farm your poultry pen you want us to do different things we can do that but when it comes about taking care of the 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 the, the livestock that you want to talk and then when you want to talk about that then you should be considering fish for fish academy so this is it we are going to see what we are going to do here come our day two. Today is our day one, as I said. Today is our day one, and here are my staff. We are well kitted. Uh, okay, okay. These are my staff. And uh, while the job was going on, we ensure that we use our nose marks because there was a lot of dust here. So while the job was on, we during the cutting of the DPC, we ensure we use our nose marks. We ensure that we put on our coverall. We ensure we use our, uh, our goggle for to protect our eye. We ensure we use our safety boot. We ensure, we, in fact, we also use our anglo. In fact, safety was taken into cognizant um, when we actually uh, did, uh, do as well. We are doing the cutting. Uh, safety first. In fact, that is one thing we are going to do from 2020. We're going to ensure that. We put first, we ensure first safety first in all our project from 2020, and we've kick started that. You can see we've not kitted like this before, we are kitting up like this for the first time because Fish Academy, as I said, we are upgrading. And uh, our, our, what all we are going to also going to be doing is going to be different from what we've been doing before. So, thank you very much. Stay tuned for our day two.
guys, it's your humble friend again, Kufre Francis. It's our day two on the project remodeling of the 45,000 capacity fish farm in Umohaya, uh, Nigeria, southeastern Nigeria. So don't forget the one you were watching was our day one, and today is our day two, being the 17th December 2019. So we are we, we've been working since yesterday, and it's still the early hours of uh, uh, 17 December 2019. So um, what we are doing, my staff, as you can see them over there, they are working, they are done excavating the entire workspace where we are going to line up the pipe. It's going to be a two-two remodeling of the pipe, uh, overflow and the discharge uh, system here in the farm. Uh, my client, having watched me on uh, my uh, various types of connection, decided to contract me this time around to, to come and do the remodeling in this particular uh, project site. Don't forget this place was not being constructed by me. Uh, looking at, looking around, you know who constructed uh, the farm. So me, my job here is to come and do remodeling of the discharge and overflow system. So you can see we are done cutting this. These are the old pipes that we use for the discharge. We are done cutting it and this for the overflow. And then um, you are going to see the, di the different thing that we are going to do here entirely. The different the type of job that we are going to do is going to be very neat. And it's, it's, it's not just being a neat job. It's a model 2020 uh, 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 remodeling uh, project. Remodeling for the 2020 that Fish Academy is known for in terms of fish farm construction. We are going to do it this we have uh, 18 models here, and we are going to do that for the same uh, for the nursery section, which you are, you've seen in the video, and you are still going to see again, and also in the nursery section. So it's your humble friend again, and it's your day two. You just need to keep watching until we conclude this project. I'm going to bring it, it's, it's going to be all in one. It's an all in one video, day one, day two, day three, day four, till the day we complete this project. Stay tuned. It's your humble friend again, Kofre Francis. I love you. Thank you.